Hey there, Amber here. We are taking an inside tour of Vera today. Vera is our 2022 uh, Thor Four Winds Class C RV. We love her so much. She's literally a part of our family, named after my late grandmother, who loved RVing. Truly, truly, the joy, one of the joys of her life. So we decided to do an inside tour of Vera today. So let's get going. All right, so um, I'm gonna turn around. Here we go. So there's the door leading you in. Here is her control panel. Very important to know. She has a generator. She has solar power. She has a propane tank. Um, she's a 30 amp plug-in. Uh, power knobs down at the steps. Then the fun part, right? So you have the couch that folds out into essentially a full bed. Then you have your little dinette here that also folds down. This goes down, those come across the top. So that's an additional full bed. There is the driving station. And ladies, I drive Vera. Yes, she's 31 feet long, but I drive her. She has backup cameras, she had size cameras. I mean, she is literally made uh, so functionally well. Women, men alike can drive Vera, pinky promise. All right, turn back. There's a ladder that goes here. The ladder is in our master closet. I will show those to you in just a minute. You have a privacy curtain. This is like a loft. My kids love this area. There's the TV. Swings out so that you can see it throughout uh, the coach. You can see it all the way in the back. It is huge and it swings all the way out and locks. Uh, blankets for beds. Sorry, she just rolled in from being gone with a family. So we're in the process of getting her re, um, re put together. Uh, privacy camera, like mentioned, you have multitudes of cabinets, lights underneath, right? Extra lights, cabinets, all of this charging station for your phone. Uh, really fun features. Okay, so the kitchen, she's gas. Uh, you have your two gas burners, then you have your induction. She does require special uh, pots and pans, and we have those. Microwave and oven right here, so that's nice. Your sink, those are the covers for the sink, all of that. Um, <clears throat> your little bunk area, by the way, there's Henry. Henry, Henry, Henry loves Vera. Uh, freezer, uh, fridge, of course, then your bunk area. Um, so this part of the RV is the slide out portion. Okay, so this actually extends with the push of a button. <clears throat> here are your two bunks. One put together, those are the sheets that we provide for all the beds. You have drawers under here. You have privacy curtains, okay? Here's another bunk. And then you have your little iPad and power outlet uh, little stations in both of the bunks. Really cool, right? Some extra storage for your little iPads and all that. Windows, you have your own lights in each bunk. This right here, a favorite. You also have a ladder that will attach here so that you can easily get to that second bunk. Uh, just like we had the ladder that I just mentioned for the loft area. We will show you that here in just a minute. Going back, oh, bathroom right here. We'll take you this way first. Bathroom, you have a shower that you can actually get in. Yes, you have venting, you have nice skylights in here. Your toilet, cabinetry, she does use special RV paper. We provide um, a lot of that. Hello, friends. We provide a lot of RV paper. Um, but should you run out on your trip, you will need to restock with RV paper because that is the only kind of paper that she um, is allowed to use. Okay, um, so your shower here. Nice. My husband is 6'5". My son is also 6'5". And they both fit in there pretty, pretty well. Okay, so that's our shower. Let's fasten her back. There we go. Okay, uh, lights, all of that. This is a sliding door here um, for privacy. And then of course you have your door that, <laughs> that closes there. Okay, continuing on to the master bedroom. A queen size bed, TV, your closet, um, extra lights all throughout here. The master bedroom has its own uh, air conditioning unit. So you have one for the front of the house and then you have one for the back of the house. So that's really, really nice. Um, my husband is extremely hot natured. And so, um, hi again. Okay. 
Here are the two uh, ladders. This is the ladder for the bunk that I mentioned. And then this is the ladder. It's slightly taller. This is the ladder for the loft area that I mentioned. And they just slide right in there. Easy peasy. Um, TV, like we mentioned, lights throughout its own unit. Of course, all the windows have pull down shades. They all have screens too. That one popped out, so we have to pop that one back in um, so that you can crank those windows open when it's nice um and uh keep nice and cool okay drawers uh everything we provide all of your linens we provide all of your towels um just extra storage she has really good storage by the way she has really good storage by the way oh one more thing to note henry i'm gonna need you to move and another door oh sorry buddy I have that closed. You can't move. Here you go. Uh, we do allow up to two dogs to uh, go with you on vacation. There's a fee for that. Um, $30 a day, I believe, but it's on the, we have all that on our right. -up. So there's an additional door and then you have this door. Henry is not going to like that so that it completely closes off. <laughs> Hi, buddy. <laughs> um, Henry is our golden retriever, obviously, and we also have Olive, who is our miniature Dotson, and they both love, love, love to go RVing in Vera, and we think you and your family will love it, too. She sleeps up to 10, okay, so you can sleep two to three up here, depending on the size of the individuals. This right here is a, is a pop-down, actually, no. This is the thing that attaches, yeah. So you have like a, a mesh net to keep uh, kids, if you decide to put little kids up there, keep them from rolling off. It snaps into both there. So just a nice little extra uh, little feature. You can sleep one to two here when this is turned down. You can sleep one to two here when this is turned down. Obviously one individual in each bunk and then two uh, individuals in the queen or three. I don't know, however your family does it. <laughs> Uh, but you can sleep up to 10 people in Vera. So that is nice, nice. Um, some of our favorite places to travel uh, are up in New England. Maine uh, is a favorite spot of ours. Stowe, Vermont is a favorite spot of ours. And then I cannot leave out Disney World. Uh, Disney World, we visit uh, at least once a year. Sometimes we've been known to go twice a year. Um, and the Disney Wilderness Campground is awesome. So, wherever you decide to take Vera, we think you'll like her. She also has an awning that stretches out, obviously, the side that has these cool LED lights that go around her. So, she's really, really cool. Uh, so, yeah. So, that's the inside tour of Vera. And we thought that would help you guys who are super visual. Um, and uh, we hope that you'll enjoy her as much as we do.